for that. <laughs> right. So, we can now change weapons. Thank the Lord. Thank you, all Monster Hunter Lords out there. Uh, we are now on the Sword and Shield, thankfully, which is great. We've also now taken out a Magnamalo again, so I'm hoping, with any luck, this has given us the opportunity, drum roll please, 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 to maybe get the Magnamalo. Oh, we've got it! Because it needed a tail. Love it. That's so good. Oh, that's so good. Right. Forge. Done. We have our first good <laughs> gun weapon. Thank you. <laughs> so there's one. That's so good. Can I make any more? Let's have a look. Double barrel shotty. Pog. It is honestly amazing. <gasps> Can we make another one? Oh my god. It. The world has felt blessed enough to give me two. Oh my god. Yes! We have two! That was such a good grind to get two done with once. Just watch the deviation. I'll have a look at that. I could always um put something on it anyway, but I should be fine. Um, I don't think I'll have enough um to make the uh, Magnum... Yeah, absolutely no chance. Oh no, you were correct with the scoop. Scoot, uh, puberty, third time. Hello? <laughs> I'd rather not go through it again. <laughs> um, the skew, that's that's weird. Why is it called the skew? Uh, that's really weird. Uh, skew is a shell, right? Is it? I haven't got a clue. I have no idea. <laughs> but it's a, a pierce level one, spread level three, level three on charges one and two, which is not bad. I would love to get it to level four though, but I'm not making a set purely to get it to level four. So there you go. Um, but I would like this because of the blast damage. I just think it's really handy. Um, and you just can't, can't fault blast, I don't think. Um, but that obviously has given us the heavy bowgun and light bowgun. I will customize these bows. So let's have a look. So the deviation is uh, lightly mild, I'm guessing that means. Lightly mild. Sniper jewel or ammo, uh, armor with steadiness. Uh, Google confirms this to be true. Oh, wow. As if. That's really weird, the fact that it's a shell, but it comes up as a claw icon. That's really weird. That's really nice to see. Um, so there's, yeah. I think... Oh, what do you mean the recoil? Left mild. Oh, so it will slightly go to the left. Ah, I get you. The one thing that would be more I'd be concerned over is the um, the recoil. So to get that down to uh, average is pretty decent. Uh, re uh, right mild. Okay, so this one slightly sways to the right. Okay, we're learning. We're learning. Uh, so now, do we want the shield or do we want the power barrel? I'm not going to be blocking stuff with a gun. I'm going to be firing at stuff with a gun. So we're going to get the power barrel. Oh my god, it makes it look incredible. <laughs> so that's what it looks like without... That's what it looks like with... That looks incredible. That is such a cool looking weapon. Oh my god, that's so cool. What does it look like with a shield? Oh no. Power, power barrel. That. That is an amazing looking weapon. That is really cool. The only now downside uh, is I need to now look at getting normal ammo three instead of two for both and then obviously getting the levels I need. So it looks like I'm going to have to be either crafting stuff or doing a lot of buying, which in all fairness is not too bad because it means um, I don't have to buy too much because I'm only using the weapon pretty much once every 12 weapons anyway. Uh, so I don't have to get that much in the you know in the sense of getting ammunition which is lovely told i told you you'll be doom guy i mean i i believe you now because look at that look how cool that looks the only thing they fear is fbdc thank you i mean <laughs> that's giving me a lot of credit for a gun i mean it looks sinister it looks sinister sinister but Probably me using it is not very sinister looking, so. 
<laughs> but that's really nice. I'm so glad I've got those two out of the way. The last one is the bow. Uh, and then, obviously, the other ones I'm looking at uh, upgrading with Magna Malo stuff is uh, the gun lance, which can probably be the last one to upgrade because currently what I've got is fairly good for where I am because it's pretty much the same as everything else. Uh, and the hunting horn, which will probably be uh, the one after bow because the current one I've got is a bit rubbish and it needs some decent stuff. So I don't have to worry about cutting the tail off. It's just literally go after the monster and, and get it done. Uh, the only thing, <laughs> can't miss with a shotty. Uh, beg to differ. Uh, my aim is not the best, but I do try. High rank arena quest with Rajang will show you all the pros. <laughs> I mean, what, with the, with the gun itself or the shield? Um, I think. It's still going to take a while to see the pros of a, of a shotgun. It looks like a shot. Yeah, it looks super good, Okami. It looks amazing. It's probably like my favorite looking weapon in this at this point. Oh, I say favorite looking weapon. Favorite looking gun weapon. Just want to preface that. Uh, easy. <laughs> Don't forget the light bow, uh, bow gun mods. Light bow gun mods are silencer or longbow. Yeah, I've already attached the silencer to the longbow, uh, to the uh, light bow gun. Uh, if I just want to make sure yes yeah, so i've already attached the silencer uh because i wanted to get rid of the recoil because i'd rather have less recoil with a light bow gun heavy bow gun i expect to have recoil um but i feel like with the light bow gun i want to be more kind of floaty so <laughs> yeah i'm gonna go for the silencer uh there are magna malo h oh really I mean, I would, but I hate arena quests. They're honestly my least favorite thing in a Monster Hunter game. Arena quest, yeah, arena quests are just not, they're just not fun. With a Naga set, see, I was looking at getting the Naga Kuga set because believe it or not, I've fought the Naga Kuga so many times, so many times that I could actually make, the can I not, oh, of course, of course it would be a cut wing. That would be the last thing I needed and an Azuchi tail. Okay. I mean, to be fair, though, that set would probably be really good for um, for gunning and being a bow. So maybe I would look at doing that. But I don't know. Shield is incredibly helpful on the heavy bow gun. It blocks attacks while you're aiming and facing it. Oh, okay. I'll, I'll mess around with the, lo uh, with the long barrel first because it looks sick. Um, and I'm hoping to not block stuff. I'm just hoping to not get hit is the main thing. Um... So for now, uh, I'll keep that in mind, though. Thank you for all of this. Um, Evade Extender is crazy skill for Rage. Yeah, I, that's what I'm thinking now. Um, considering it won't take me long to fight a, a, a Nagakuga and a, an Azuchi. Um, it's an interesting one. Because I'll definitely get a cut wing. I will get a singular cut wing. And the Azuchi tail will take me five seconds to get. So it that could be... I know I said I wasn't going to get... Um, armor specifically for weapons but if i've already got access to being able to get you know i'm um, actually i'm gonna need way more cut wings aren't i i need four in total so i've only yeah so i'd need four but i would be able to make them if i got the, that four so that could be a possibility yeah definitely definitely thinking about it Maybe that could be something I do at a later date. Um, I feel like I've just fought the Naga Kuga so many times at this point that it's just become absolutely ridiculous. And I can't can't keep fighting the Naga Kuga. It's just going to get old real quickly. So, water break because I'm thirsty. If you're all uh, thirsty as well, make sure you're drinking because it's a healthy thing to do. I want you all to stay hydrated. Uh, on this uh, stream with me today, tonight, morning, wherever you are. So, we'll unlock these optional quests again, get the perma buffs because we might as well. So, sword and shield time. What do I want to take out with a sword and shield? A little part of me feels more comfortable going up against the Anjanath with the sword and shield so i think that's what we're doing which will also give us the next rank up as well but like i said we're making sure we're completing all the quests um and then hopefully we'll see what what goes on 
Uh, just want to have a quick look. If you are not a follower of the stream, it's that time again for me to plug myself, which is a really weird thing to do. If you are not a follower of the stream, please feel free to follow me. I'm live every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Um, today is a special day because tomorrow is, you know, uh, a long one for me, so I won't be able to stream. But you'll get notified when I'm live. It supports me, a small channel. Uh, hopefully will become your favourite channel because I'm just that type of guy. Um, and, you know, I get to see your name. You get to see a number incre uh, increase. You know, what's not, what's not to love? It makes me happy. And you want to see me happy, don't you? And it's free. I will admit it is free. <laughs> so, thank you. <laughs> I love uh, SH. SH? SH. Hang on a sec. S not switch hat. SH. Hang on a second. SH. 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 E what do you mean by SH? Do we sword and shield? Is that what you want about? So, sword and shield, thank you. Oh, <laughs> it took me a minute. I could have realized. I should have really realized, but I'm that type of person. Yeah, sword and shield's really good. Uh, I just suck with the sword and shield. A little thing for everyone new to the stream currently uh, is I suck with every weapon apart from the hammer because the hammer is my main weapon. Uh, so <laughs> you will see how bad I am with everything as the streams go on and on. And on. <laughs> so, without further ado, let's fight this Anjanath. Funny thing is, uh, I should be alright with the Anjanath um, because I got the armor for the Anjanath for my uh, solo character. I say solo character, my main character, because it has Slugger as a skill on the armor set, and that Remember for a hammer is it's all right. It's not too bad. Um, and I think it also had attack up, which you can't really, like, blame me for going for. Um, plug in the Discord. There is a gathering hub there for hunters to get together and grab. Ah! Th thank you, Rose. So, I recently added... Obviously, currently, I, I only play Monster Hunter, which is my main game for the, for the channel. But I will be diversifying the content sooner or later. But as a way to stick me firmly in the Monster Hunter group, I have made a gathering hub in my Discord, which if you type exclamation point Discord or exclamation point socials, you will see uh, the links to if you join that. Uh, and for all the people that don't know, if you agree to the rules, you will be able to... Thank you, Toasted Waffles. Uh, if you agree to the rules, uh, which you just need to give a thumbs up to them in the rules ch uh, section, you will become a member, which will allow you to chat to others like myself and others who watch the channel. Um, and be able to just ask for assistance in any quest you need. Um, because there are a few people that have joined the actual um, Discord, but have decided to not read the rules and not become a full member. So they've joined for the ability to see the notifications of when I go live, but they haven't gained the ability to chat. I mean, all you need to do is agree to the rules and it's just basically like, don't be don't be a, a dick. <laughs> That's pretty much what it is, is don't be rude. Don't, you know, target people and all that. Um, and if you can't agree to those rules, then I think I'd rather you not be in the group anyway. So I guess that's fine. Um, but, you know, it'd be more, you'll get more out of the Discord if you agree to the rules uh, and be a nice person. So you can chat to me and others. So there you go. There's my little plug <laughs> for the stream. Thank you very much, Rose, for uh, reminding me that there is that in the Discord. And thank you, Toasted Waffles, for uh, uh, putting the link. See, moderators, man, they're incredible. Big ups to them. Everyone give them a round of applause. They've been amazing this stream. They've really been helping me out. <laughs> probably wouldn't be having an easy... I'd probably have a worse time if I didn't have moderators. They've been making my life really easy, actually. So thank you very much for your assistance. <laughs> and the work you do. So thank you so much. Oh, man, I'm whiffing totally with this uh, sword and shield. It, it doesn't help that the, the legs are actually resistant to a lot of stuff. <laughs> so that makes it really difficult. Uh, I only swear, <laughs> the one swear of the night. Yeah, exactly. I try not to uh, to swear. I feel like I did accidentally swear at some point near the beginning, 
Um, but I try not to just because I want to keep it family friendly. So I do apologize. Uh, don't feed toasters eager. To be honest, <laughs> nah, do it. It's cool. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, no, I do appreciate all the assistance I get. Um, it does mean the world to me that people are giving their free time to assist me. <laughs> a lowly streamer uh, who likes to stream video games uh, for the uh, benefit of others. So it does help me out a lot. <laughs> oh. So, Anjanath is going all right. Trying to trying to take it out fairly easily, but I remembered that the sword and shield is actually really difficult to use for me um, because, especially against an Anjanath, because it's so tall. Like, I can't really get like a good combo going unless I do this, which will then allow me to. I saw 39. I saw damage numbers of 39. I'm gonna take it. Uh, it's what we want to see more of. I'd rather more 39s. But um, for now, you know, whatever I get will do. What was broken? What? Ella. I'm, I thank you so much for being, you know, the amazing dog you are. The leg broke. Ah, see, that makes sense. I also have been attacking the leg, so that does make total sense. <laughs> uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh, I don't know how, how I did that. Honest, oh, that's my time to duck and run. Toasted is a Chad. He is. Of course. Of course. To be fair, Toasted has helped me out a fair bit. So thank thank him as much as you can. And thank Rose as well. They've both been helping me out tremendously. Oh my god, I just noticed where my health is. And I'm scared that I'm going to lose Moxie to an Anjanath. Okay, back in the fight. Here we go. Okay, scared for a sec, but it's fine. Do some damage as much as I can. This might be a longish fight, but Sword and Shield tip, use A instead of X when you jump off the monster. Oh, so like if I do this, for example, and then, oh, that's completely wrong. Oh, uh, wait, no, I think I get what you mean. When I do that whole jump back and then hit them and they go in the air. Oh, is it because I get um the, uh, what's the move? I get shock damage, right? I, I, I'm pretty sure I do like impact stuff, right? Let's try, try a second here. There we go. Oh, uh, well, I mean, I feel like I would demonstrate it there if I did it correctly, but <laughs> I didn't. So let's try this again. Oh, whoop. Okay, back up. There we go. And then, okay. Yeah, so you do like a nice shield bash, but I'm nowhere near the face. So I'd rather use the, um, the slicing because I feel like if I'm near the face, I'll definitely do the impact hit, but... I don't think there's no need. Uh, there's no need to uh, to do it when you're not near the face. I need to get that other sub camp as well. I think it's like above two, so I need to remember to get that. Is the dog coming? There we go. Okay. Here we go. Let's uh, sharpen up again. Get some uh, perma buffs going as well. The only reason I'm now calling them perma buffs and not endemic life is because after getting that optional quest, it reminded me. I see the lucky owl. Where you at? There you are. Because you're gonna give me stuff. Thank you. Lovely. And we can head on over back to the Anjanath. Can we make it? We did. The dog's a lot more agile than I, I thought. Uh, damage is higher from the A hit. A uh, X is cutting damage, which is nice. Because if I get it on the tail, it means I'm going to get a, more of a chance to uh, cut the tail off. Um, but yeah, A is more damage. But I feel like I'd rather aim for the A um, hit when I'm near the face. Because it obviously is impact. And I'm going to get... Uh, more damage. Oh my god, is it mountable? As if? What? Oh, it's because I've been doing loads of aerial hits, of course. That makes total sense. Right, let's do that. And we'll switch around, hopefully. Get over here, and then... Oh, so close. So close. Can we try and cut the tail off? Let's... Oh, no. I just wanted to... I need to move the camera around so I can do it correctly. Missed. That was a massive whiff. It's fine, though. Nice! I broke something, though. I, that's fine. <laughs> oh, let's not get hit again because I'd rather... I mean, I, to be fair, I haven't really been going for the tail, so it's unlikely that I'm going to get the tail car, uh, hit on... Hit? The tail cut during this quest. There we go. Ooh. Uh, damage. Yeah, okay, so I read that just making sure. Sometimes I get nervous in missing uh, chat because I've done that a few times and I don't want to make people feel like I'm not reading their stuff because I feel like... 
as a small streamer, I think the best thing you can do is to make sure you're engaging with chat as much as you can. Um, because it's probably like the only time, like, I, I, I hope I do one day. If I did, it'd be great. Um, if I got popular, it would be very difficult to uh, read chat when it's just zooming past. So, um, can I just do like, can I do like a little bit and then will this hit? Oh, that it would have, it would have. Can we? Oh, that, that even scared me, that scared me. <laughs> I didn't even expect to hit the range on this, like the shot of the sword was a lot more than I thought. Oh man, that was bad. Oh. <laughs> Okay, let's try this again. At least the legs are, uh, are, uh, oh, nice. Okay, this is going to give me a chance to, uh, attack the tail a bit more. There we go. Hopefully get the cut, maybe? I mean, if I carve, nope. I was trying to swerve it a little bit. That didn't help. Chat is a write-off in massive streams. I just close it. Yeah, to be honest, that's, uh, it gets to that point. I mean, I would love for one, like, to one day have that, you know, viewership. It would just... It would be great, like, one, because it just means I'm doing something right. Um, <laughs> do you know what I mean? I just think after a while, it just means amazingly to me. It mean, uh, it'd mean a lot to me if I got loads of viewers, but to be fair, I'm really happy with the views I get because, one, you're all chatty, which is lovely. I'd be upset if none of you wanted to talk, if it was just such a si silent chat. I don't know what I'd do. Do you know what I would do? Just still chat. I talk to myself anyway, so <laughs> it's like there's nothing new. I've just got someone else to talk to, which is actually really, really nice. So I just want to give a massive shout out to everyone in the chat now to say thank you for uh, chatting to me and uh, being a part of the stream. It does mean a lot to me because you could be like me because I'm probably I'm the worst person. I'm a streamer who is um, a lurker in the chat. It's honestly the worst thing. Um, I am trying to get better just so I can support others because I think having an active chat is so One of the benefits I think of being a live streamer um, is the fact that you have the ability to chat to people in real time So I want to thank you all for giving me that option to chat to you while I play a game. Oh my god It actually happened. Are you serious? I'm actually in shock <laughs> That I've actually got the uh, the tail cut. That's surprising. I mean, I feel like sometimes the tail cut is really easy to do, but um, other times I feel like it's a it's a job's worth. It's an absolute job's worth. Easy, thank you, Waffles. I do appreciate that. <laughs> sometimes it's not easy and uh, make it look it, but it's a, a, a lot of fumbling about. <laughs> Don't forget about back hop. Don't forget about back hop. Do, do you mean the thing I'm already doing where I do this? Or... Oh, that was sick! Sorry, I just got well excited. Because <laughs> I do, I feel like I do that a fair bit anyway. Or do you mean the actual back hop? Like, if I press... Oh, no, I'm actually just... Hang on. Is there a way? Oh, no, I have no clue how to do it. I think that's what I'm on. I think that's what you're on about, right? Please tell me if I'm right. <laughs> I hope I'm right. Because <laughs> I do that a fair bit anyway. It's probably my favorite move for the sword and shield. Oh. Just being able to jump back, hit, and then go straight in the air and do some sick damage. Like a pro, thank you. See, I feel like, Okami, you've thrown that out a few times during the stream. Which, thank you, you have so much faith in me. But I am nowhere near a pro. <laughs> like, <laughs> I feel like a lot of my success is blunder. Like, it's literally just such supreme luck. Um, for invincibility, doing aerial bash attack or pressing X. Oh, yeah, so that... Oh, my God, my health. Um, so what I was doing before, I think, is what you're on about, right? Um, I think. I want to say it is. Oh, my God, have you actually put down a trap? Oh, my God, Leon. You've got that ability now? Oh, my God, I knew this is why I kept you around, Leon. This is why I made you the cat you are. Oh, my God, that's... That's... In that's amazing. That's so good. <laughs> oh my god, yes. Thank you. Okay, right. I should really sharpen because, I mean, yellow sharpness is not where you want to be. <laughs> like attack, uh, uh, like attack was, oh, really? That's pretty cool. Uh, oh, sorry, excuse me. Um, 
You've interrupted my um, me time with uh, Anjanath here. I mean, yeah, you can, you two can fight. I mean, if you end up killing Anjanath, I'm fine with that. I mean, that's really good. So it's actually Anjanath lost that fight. So I'm actually going to get on Anjanath quickly and then going to bash into Basarios and then just use Basarios. There we go. And then that should allow me to ride. There we go. See, now this is actually professional. I do admit this is actually going really well. Oh, 20 damage. I mean, exactly. That's what we want to see. I want to see more than that, actually, game. Oh, that's a really strong move, but slow to get out. There we go. 63. Oh, it's dead. We're good. It's all good. Thank you, Basarios. You, um, you helped me there. Let's get the tail first and the drops because I might as well. And you have pelt. Makalai or from the um, Basarios, which is nice. Uh, let's wait while Basarios <laughs> will grow up until Gravios. I cannot wait. I really do hope they add Gravios because it's just such a cooler looking monster. And it, it's, I just think it's better. <laughs> it's so much better than Basarios. Um, I think they'll add it when they add eventually a G rank. Um, they might not add a G rank when I think about it, but they might add it in the future. <laughs> See, you are good in Monster Hunter most of the time. Thank it is most of the time, definitely most of the time, but it is a lot of luck. Um, I think a lot of my playstyle does lend itself to a little bit of luck here and there, which is really bad to say. <laughs> His tail's on fourth gen, what do you mean? Oh, do you mean the way it's going? <laughs> How many tails have I just got? Uh, so I, I didn't carve it, but the guild, I'm, I'm using, um, <laughs> oh, Gravios' tail. Oh, okay. Um, Anjanath, one tail, two tail. What's that about? What's that about? I'm okay with it, because I'm going to need the tails eventually if I make the weapon and or armor, but uh, two. I'm okay with that. I'm, I'm not going to say no. <laughs> I'm not going to say no. So, in that fight, Leon has reminded me of something. Something I've actually been ne neglecting um, and something that I should have been really paying attention to. So, it's unlocked. Oh! Oh, yeah, because that was the key quest to get Armadron in the Shrine Ruins. Here we go. At any rate, we can't have this thing near Kimura. We have to stop it before it gets any closer. As a proud hunter of Kimura, you are tasked with taking it down. The urgent quest has been registered with Hanoa. We're counting on you. Uh, counting on you now, I should say. So get to it. Oh, okay. So we now have the Armadron unlocked for our next urgent quest to get to six star, which I'm going to say... I'm pretty sure that's the final rank offline so we're so close to finishing the offline section um of this challenge which is lovely um the monster came from chernobyl wow wow i mean i feel like to be fair is it gravios yeah gravios literally just emerges from lava so i feel like it would be <laughs> it's pretty bad so we now have armadron which is great because that then gives us access to six star which i think is the last one i'm gonna say it's the last one i'll have to do some digging but it's fine